Therapeutic proteins are complex molecules produced by living cells that treat a range of diseases. These proteins are long-folded polymers made up of amino acid chains. There can be thousands of amino acid residues present within a therapeutic protein. Variables in cell culture conditions, such as temperature, can lead to protein modifications, such as oxidation, deamidation or lysine truncation. Modifications can make the protein more basic or acidic. This results in a protein population that is heterogeneously charged. Small variations in the charge of a protein can reduce drug efficacy or cause an immune response in patients. Therefore, controlling charge variants is critically important for product quality and safety. Until recently, ion exchange chromatography with a salt-based gradient has commonly been used for analysing protein charge variants. As proteins move through the column, they are separated based on their relative ionic strength. The columns are packed with polymeric beads grafted with stationary phase chains which interact with charged molecules. The protein continually competes with salt for access to charged sites on the stationary phase. As the salt concentration increases, proteins are displaced and move through the column, releasing and rebinding along the way. Over a lengthy salt gradient, the protein charge variants are separated and detected. Salt gradients can be as long as an hour and must be carefully optimised for each and every drug candidate. This is both time-consuming and challenging when transferring methods, ultimately costing more, as candidates progress through drug development. pH gradients are becoming increasingly popular due to their speed, simple method development and easy transferability between laboratories. When using a pH gradient, there is only a single binding event to the stationary phase. When pH is increased, the protein variant leaves the stationary phase depending on its isoelectric point and no rebinding occurs. Consequently, pH gradients offer superior resolution, speed and sensitivity compared to traditional salt gradients. Both columns and gradients can be short. And fast platform methods can be optimised easily without loss of resolution for multiple candidates. With a linear pH gradient, protein variants can confidently be separated in seconds with excellent reproducibility. Homemade pH buffers, which typically contain phosphate, are non-linear, give unpredictable retention times and are troublesome to make. The clever scientists at Thermo Fisher Scientific have a solution. Thermo Scientific CX1 pH gradient buffers are easy to make and give linear gradients with reproducible retention times, run after run. Simply dilute your high and low pH buffer concentrates by a factor of 10. In just a few minutes, you're ready to begin your analysis with ease and confidence. Thermo Scientific CX1 pH gradient buffer kits save you time and deliver more confident separations to ensure your product quality and accelerate your time to market. <laughs>